here. <laughs> Sorry. I won't say no to free food, but why are you giving away cereal bars? I always have one on my person, and you look like you're about to pass out back there. Have you eaten lunch yet? How'd the open house go? The usual. We got a bigger crowd than normal because of the property's fame, but really, no different from the typical open house. On second thought, it actually looks like a fancy party more than an open house. I've never felt so underdressed in my life. Weren't you there? I wasn't really listening. I should have asked someone to kick you out. <laughs> no, you won't. And what makes you so sure? One, ever since you got assigned to this property, you've been freaking out about it. Rebecca's words, not mine. She's been complaining to me about how you talked your ears off, by the way. Two, despite your initial qualms about the place, you still took the job. Which brings us to three. It's been months since you last settled a deal, and you're short on money right now since you're back to your instant noodle diet. How do you even know about the last one? Rebecca. Anyhow, you're hell-bent on selling the mansion. Even if someone you know personally is in the tour group, you aren't going to just kick them out. Every single person who went on your open house is still a prospective client to you. Even me. I hate you. I really hate you right now. <laughs> I'll have you know that there's already someone who's extremely interested in this property. So even if you expressed any sort of interest in it, I don't think they'd be willing to let you have it. Too bad. You don't seem too happy about it. I am happy! Doesn't this look like a happy face to you? Really? And here I was thinking you found another one stuffed in the sofa. Or is it the wardrobe this time? Yeah, well, things happened. Stuff the right couple might not be pleased about. No need to make a fuss about it. It's normal in the business. You made them angry? Not angry. Just... stuff happened. Like? Things. Did they do anything? Your clients. The rights, was it? You keep asking me about my work, yet you haven't said a single word about yours. That's not fair. Both you and Zack have literally disappeared off the face of the Earth. Didn't we just talk a week ago over chat? That's different! Linking your awful memes in the group chat box every morning isn't exactly a conversation. Excuse me, I don't hear you calling them awful while you're laughing at all of them. Shut up! And you aren't answering my question! Alright, alright! Lay off on the abuse! Remember that case I mentioned before? 
We've been trying to pin the bastard down, but it required more work than we anticipated. The guy's slippery like that. We got some good lead months ago, 